All right, y'all, I'm back again. Got these ruffles. Okay, so ruffles has their different textures. Um, I like a classic ruffle myself. The texture is perfect. You don't need to do nothing with it. But they have a double crunch ruffle, and it just means that the ridges that are in ruffles are deeper. They're not kind of like this. They're deep, okay? Deeper ridges, double crunch. And we have honey mustard. So honey mustard is an acquired taste. I usually, I hadn't met a honey mustard thing that I don't like. I like honey mustard. I like mustard. So let's see. Sometimes honey mustard can be a little too sweet. Be a little too tangy. It just depends. Pretty straightforward though. I don't think I need to do much with that. Sniffy, sniff, sniff. Okay. First thing I'm getting is like a vinegar. Like a vinegar, like, like tangy. Okay. All right. Let's pick out a good one. Okay. Here we go really deep ridges look at that that's what i'm talking about almost like wavy lays right okay um they're yellow i don't know if you can really tell that they're a little bit more yellow than normal chips and then there's like a there's like a seasoning on there here we go One more. Hey, honestly, the taste is quite subtle. Um, if it was a blind, you know, I always do that. If I didn't know what I was looking for, Mustard would be like one of the last things that I would be like. Is that mustard? Is that is that mustard? Like I can't necessarily say that that jumps out at you. It's sweet. It's kind of tangy, but the mustard is very subtle. I don't know that that's a bad thing. I taste other spices. Look what else is in here? Potatoes, vegetable oil, sugar, salad style mustard. Molasses, salt, onion powder, spices, paprika. Y'all know, it's a very subtle, even all, all the other flavors that's in there, it's good, but it's subtle. So the subtly flavored chips, I would say, are good accompaniment to like subs or whatever, like sandwiches. Um, but yeah, it's kind of subtle, kind of faint. I don't, I'm not mad at it, but it's not like, it didn't blow me away. But, you know, you don't want anything extra mustardy, though, do you? Unless you're just, like, one of them, you know, big mustard fans. And I'm not. I like it, but it's not. I don't need I don't need that. I don't think I need that in my life. But these are good. Mm, 7 out of 10, maybe. They're straight. That crunch is good, though. That texture is what's up. The texture is really, really good. These actually will be good with a dip. Maybe not this flavor, but this texture will be really good with a dip. It is strong. It is quite sturdy. I like that crunch. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm a texture person as well as a taste person. And, um, yeah, 7 out of 10 because it's, it's subtle. And I think I like that. I actually think I like the fact that it's subtle.